action, comedy, drama, fantasy, horror, mystery, romance, thriller, western, audio drama. Whether they be brand new shows that haven't yet started, some of your current favorites, or shows from long ago you should revisit, every month I will shine a spotlight on some of the great shows you can listen to wherever you like to listen to quality podcasts at. In our first offering, When the World is Devastated by Unnatural Weather Phenomenon, people around the world do any and everything they can to survive, which is what David, his family, and his best friend do. After a year of isolating underground, they emerge to see the sun is blotted out by the ash of many volcanic eruptions, and that nature has reclaimed the city that they once called home. But while this is concerning, the real fight is from what comes out of the ashes. About a year ago, everything changed. I must apologize if I sound unsure about the time. We tried to keep track of it, but it's been difficult since we've been 50 feet underground for a long time. If you are listening to this, then that means you're either a survivor or a descendant of those who have survived. If you're a survivor, then that means there's a chance that we're still alive, and if you're listening to this, can contact me on the frequency 14.060. I want to know who is out there. If you're a descendant, then that means we are no longer here, and you're the future of the human civilization. I'm not sure if you've been told the story of what happened. But suddenly, the world was devastated by abnormal weather conditions. Category 5 tornadoes, tidal waves, severe hailstorms, earthquakes. But by far the most devastating was the eruption of several of the world's supervolcanoes. The ash blew into the sky, not only plunging us into a continuous cold, but leaving the world blanketed in darkness. When we emerged from the bunker to see what was left, we learned more than we bargained for. Sit back, and let me tell you the story of what came out of the ashes. And in our second offering, Dr. Edison Tucker is having a very weird life. Not being able to die tends to color things that way. Luckily, the strange and unusual is something of her specialty. And Ed set her sights and Wonderkind grant money on the strangest town in America, Jerusalem, Oregon. She'll certainly get her EMF meter's worth between an eccentric housemate, quirky town folks, and the mysteries lurking just beyond the tree line. Ed's going to find the answers she's been searching for. She just might not be ready for what finds her. This is routine update log number six for Dr. Edison Tucker concerning my research into the town of Jerusalem, Oregon, and the existence of the supernatural, paranormal, mythological, and etc., etc., blah, blah, blah. Anyway... Since arriving, I've definitely encountered some stuff that could be classified under weird ass. The other day, I found what looked like claw marks in the vegetable patch wiring, and nobody in town will talk to me about the picnic area near Lincoln's farm. Although, that could be because everybody thinks I'm one of those monster hunting idiots. Which I'm not, okay? I am an experienced professional who takes my work extremely seriously, and I am going to prove this if it's the last thing I ever- Dr. Tucker, what have I told you about keeping samples in the fridge? <sighs> Although to be honest, I think the 
biggest mystery on my hands is how I'm going to survive living with Lucille Kensington, stuck-up extraordinaire. So, if you guys don't hear from me again, it wasn't something in the woods that got me. Probably. So as we turn off our spotlight for this month, if you would be interested in having your show featured in future episodes, please visit our website at hauntedgriffin.com. Also, while tunnels may be finished, the team at Haunted Griffin Entertainment is continuing to work on content for you, and if you would like to help support our endeavors, please become a patron. Where, for as little as a dollar a month, you can get early access to all of our content, as well as access to our Patreon-only anthology series, Ghosts of Griffin. For more information on everything we're working on, visit our website, follow us on social media, or join our Discord. And, as always, support audio drama. Listen, follow, subscribe, and share. <laughs>